I will never regret is speaking my mind about how I felt about what they were asking us to do. It wasn't that I got fired, it was the way it was done. From 1993 until 1998, we were going out, dating, and laughing with Khadija, Sinclair, Maxine, and Regine. They managed to hold their own with shows like Seinfeld and Friends. And the main reason they stayed on for five seasons is because they were hilarious. Uh, we'd love to stay, but boring conversation isn't on our schedule. Ciao! But things were not so bright off screen. For example, Queen Latifah wore a necklace with the key on it on the show. That key was from the bike Latifah bought for her brother, who passed away in a motorcycle accident. From the first episode, Khadijah was breaking barriers. She was a graduate of Howard University. She had her own publishing business, Running Flavor Magazine, where she represented and talked about the interest of the African-American community. She was also a killer ball player. While she seemed like she had it all together on the show, in real life, Queen Latifah was struggling. While they were taping the first season of Living Single in 1992, Latifah bought her older brother Lancelot Jr. a bike. That same year, he lost his life in a horrible motorcycle accident. And if you ever saw her wearing a key necklace on the show, just know that it was the key of her brother's bike. Latifah carried it with her like a memento. Having lost my brother when I was 22 years old, one of the closest people in my entire life, Three years after the incident, she and her then-boyfriend, Sean Moon, were victims of a carjacking. When the situation escalated, her boyfriend was shot. She claimed that this was a traumatic moment that scarred her for life. When she appeared in Living Single at 23, Queen Latifah had already made a name for herself, but instead of acting, she spent most of her 20s rapping. Before the show, she released three albums, the first one hitting the public when she was only 19. After the show ended, Queen Latifah focused more on her acting career. The 53 year old landed a lead in the movie Set It Off, which appeared in theaters in 1996. 